Hi guys, Transport RC here. So today I'm going to be doing a battery test on the Cocoon FPV HD camera drone, also known as the SEMA X5 UW. So I'll be doing an outdoor battery test. We are in this park today. Very nice day, very clear. No wind at all. So great day for flying a drone like this. I will also be doing an indoor battery test that will be right after this clip so just keep watching so let's get started turn on the remote turn on the drone I believe it's on can't really see cause of the sun yes it is it's on connect the controller calibrate the gyros should be all set just get my ipad here gonna do a screen record for the time for the stopwatch can't really see because of the bright lights and here we go three two one start Okay, so the drone didn't do too bad. Eight minutes and 37 seconds. Very happy with that. The company did say, Cocoon did say six to eight minutes, I believe. So actually passed that. But I don't recommend you draining the battery to, till the drone automatically lands. That is very bad for the battery, so don't do that. One thing that I did forget to mention at the start of the video was that the drone was flown in speed mode one and the camera was not recording to maximize the battery and to have the most realistic results for a battery test. A very good day as you can see. Great day for flying drones. So straight after this clip I'll be doing an indoor battery test so I'll see you guys at the end of the video.
Okay guys, so for the final conclusion on the Cocoon FPV HD camera drone, very nice drone. 7 minutes and 7 seconds for the indoor battery test and 8 minutes and 37 seconds for the outdoor battery test. I was very impressed. Just impressed. Like, 8 minutes for a drone with a 500 milliamp battery? It's just like outstanding. Also, I was surprised that the indoor battery test was shorter. The flight time of the indoor battery test was shorter, but that might have just been because the wind generated from the propellers bouncing off the walls and buffering my drone might have shortened the life, uh, flight time of the drone. Of course, the days that I flew outdoors, there was basically no wind at all, zero wind. So there was like zero kilometers wind. So this is the battery, 500 milliamps, very small. It is proprietary, but you can get this this battery from like if you live in Australia, Audi or the Cocoon website, I believe, or you can just go on eBay and buy it from SEMA. Cause the SEMA X, you, cause you can use the SEMA X five UW batteries from for this drone, as this is just a rebrand of the SEMA X five UW. The batteries are pretty cheap, so really, if you want some extra flight time, I would recommend getting some extra batteries for this drone but this drone flew really well I was really impressed with the drone and yeah basically the flight characteristics were just good I feel like I have full control of the drone the drone did dip a bit when I moved forward or when I flew it forward but that's just because this is like a pretty cheap drone so I think there's actually no barometer in this drone it just kind of guesses the altitude you hold like some drones have barometers which tell you which tell the drone how high it is how low it is but i don't think this drone has a barometer so basically so it did kind of dip when i was flying but that was okay i just used the throttle and throttled it up a bit but this drone is a very good drone seven minutes and seven seconds for the indoor battery test and eight minutes and 37 seconds for the outdoor battery test i was just impressed and also the cocoon did say the flight time was seven to eight minutes so they weren't misleading the consumer so yeah so i would recommend getting this drone if this is your first drone that you want to get this is a very good drone and if you find it on sale damn it is cheap so thank you guys for watching and i'll be doing some more tests on this drone like a camera review also and um, i'm not sure I might also do a speed test on the drone so stay tuned thank you guys for watching and i'll see you guys in the next video